good evening my dear students last class we studied about sex determination and about the y chromosome and the male development this class we are going to study about a new topic genetic balance in drosophila genetic balance is nothing but how we how sex is determined in drosophila through gene we are going to study that concept the gene gene is present on chromosomes now you see there are three chromosomes are given y chromosome x chromosome autosomes first y chromosome as you already know <clears throat> y chromosome is essential for the fertility of male sex that means it only determine the sex male sex maleness but the characteristic maleness it never determine so but it does not determine the maleness that means the characteristics of male then x chromosome x chromosome contain gene for femaleness as well as female sex autosomes autosomes mean the body chromosome contain gene for maleness that means the characteristic features of male what are the characteristic features of male all physical appearances testis breast development the voice changes bird mustache all are the characteristics of male the masculineness now in 1921 calvin b bridges he experimented in drosophila and he provide one new theory is called genetic balance theory <clears throat> what does it states sex in drosophila is determined by the balance between the gene for femaleness gene for femaleness located on x chromosome and those for maleness lo located on the autosomes so the balance between sex x chromosome and autosome determine the sex in drosophila that is all uh, that is also called otherwise called sex index here it is given one simple formula by explaining this theory number of x chromosomes by number of sets of autosomes x by a that is called sex index now let us see the example here here in drosophila this is triploid female that means three x chromosomes and three pairs of three sets of autosomes diploid male 2a plus xy so when you cross the triploid female and diploid male the following gametes are produced during the maturity time 2a plus xx a plus x 2a plus x a plus xx here 2a plus xy the gamete is a plus x a plus y there are two gametes are possible either x or y now let you make the cross by between these gametes of female and male you can put one square checker board that is called a punnett square board you already studied in 10th standard as well as in botany related to mono hybrid cross and di hybrid cross by applying the same checker board here this row is a uh, male and this row completely female now when you cross multiply this to this 2a plus xx into a plus x 3a plus triple x in such a way triploid female forms triploid intersex 3a plus xx y means intersex 2a plus xx plus a plus y in the same way when you <clears throat> add or when you multiply this one to this one 2a plus x into a plus x 2a plus x into a plus y you can see 3a plus x is intersex 3a plus xy is super male and here a plus xx into a plus x a plus xx into a plus y you can see 2a plus triple x super female and 2a plus xx y diploid female now you are going to <clears throat> a plus x into a plus x 2a plus triple double x xx diploid normal female 
in the same way a plus x into a plus y to a plus x y diploid male that is normal male in such a way the autosome and sex chromosome is balanced this theory is called genic balance theory now you see there are some values the sex index values in an organism number of x chromosome is 3 number of autosome sets is 2 then sex index is x by a 3 by 2 is equal to 1 by 1.5 such a individual is meta female or super female whenever the number of x chromosome 4 now autosome 4 sets of autosome 4 4 4 4 by 4 1 3 3 3 by 3 1 2 2 2 by 2 the sex index is 1 1 1 the sex index 1 by 1 is equal to 1 when the sex index value 1 comes this and all normal female when sex index value comes below 1 0.67 x chromosome number of x chromosome 2 autosome 3 2 by 3 0.67 then intersex results when the sex index is exactly 0.5 that means 0.50 is normal male so x chromosome 1 and number of sets of autosome 2 1 by 2 is equal to 0.5 normal male when number of x chromosome is 1 and number of autosome sets is 3 then sex index is 1 by 3 the value 0.33 the sex index value then the phenotype of drosophila is meta male or super male so meta female normal female intersex normal male super male all these are the genetic balance mechanism on the chromosome to determine the sex in drosophila it is also applicable to human as in the case of transgender so tomorrow we will come with dosage compensation and other interesting topics i hope you understood thank you